Hello and welcome to Formations of a Noble Woman channel, a channel where we just share issues about womanhood, the woman and the will of God concerning the same. And today we want to talk foundations. The foundation of something is so important and actually I had the privilege of watching the laying of the foundation of the house where we live um, if you want to look at take a look uh, i watched the foundation of that house being laid uh, a few months well a number of months ago well it is quite a modest a modest house as you saw but we were really shocked to see i think we were not prepared for that shock because we had never really involved ourselves in a major building project we were really shocked to see how much went into the foundation actually we wondered whether we would be able to build the house because it kept literally swallowing up our startup resources and you know we live by faith so we wondered Lord will we be able to sustain this and we got an idea of what Jesus meant when he said who of you uh, wanting to build a house would first of all sit down and count the cost to see whether they would be able to build or you know to sustain the house until it was fully done so there is always the option of compromising the foundation you know uh, putting in a little material than what is required really because of the cost of the foundation and we know that the news around us abound with stories of compromised foundations. We have seen buildings fall down and cause the loss of lives, the loss of property, you know, really grief and loss because our foundation was compromised. And so you see when we talk about foundations, you can see that this is a really serious matter and now coming down to our topic we are uh, I want us to just look at the scripture that Jesus gave in Matthew 7 in Matthew 7 Jesus talks about two men you know who built their houses one was a foolish one who built on sand the other one was the wise builder who built on rock and uh, Jesus talks of this man who hears the words he spoke and or he speaks even to death I believe and puts them into practice It's like that man who built his house on rock and it stood the test of time and then there's this foolish one who had but he didn't put the words into practice and his house you know fell with a great crash and we know that um, these two houses faced similar conditions if you look at them they were both similar and yet the results uh, of what happened were very very different so when we talk about foundations we are really talking about the story of our lives what is your foundation like and what is my foundation like what have I built my life on and can my foundation stand the test of time can my foundation be able to stand the issues of life that abound around us so that uh, they affect and usually the foundation will dictate how I behave towards a circumstance how I act when I am in a situation and so as we talk about formations of a noble woman we are asking on what have you based on on what have you built your foundation what is your foundation like can we talk of the Lord uh, working right from your foundation to form you into the woman that he wants you to be well and the foundation of a building is not seen actually it's the building that is seen and when the storms of life hit that building it is the part that is seen that will actually crumble down the same way with us women what is seen is actually not the actual foundation it is not what holds us it is what is not seen but the trouble with us women is we will focus on the outward we will focus on what is seen we will focus on what people think or say about us and so as we talk about foundations I want to 
uh, uh, ask us to reflect on that and to see whether your foundation is deep or you're focusing on what people can see that I go to church uh, that I'm raising my children well you know what we can see are you focusing on the outward what will determine whether you have a strong foundation or not and so we will continue with this conversation so please consider liking subscribing sharing be part of these conversations leave a comment right down there and as I, I always like uh, to leave people with a point to reflect on please reflect on your life reflect on your foundation let's ask what is my foundation like is it built on something that can stand the test of time or will issues bombard me and I find myself falling flat like the foolish builder so reflect on foundation and until we meet next time it is bye from me and look out for that next week